Yo, what's good, Dingus of all ages? It's Death Hawk here, and today I'm joined by the not so famous, but just as equally as a person Important. as me. <laughs> Theater Z Warrior. Theater Warrior underscore no. <laughs> one. Wait, wait, no, there's no underscore. What are you saying? <laughs> there definitely is. What are you talking about? No, it's just the one. It's no underscore in between the one and the warrior. Oh, whatever. There should have been. <laughs> oh, whatever. Oh, it's. This is beside. Welcome to the Great Debate. The Great Debate. Dun, dun, dun. Sha, sha, sha. And today we're going to be talking about extinctions versus zombies. And Dylan, why don't you start first since it's on your channel? All right, this is going to be on your channel. I yes, think. Yes, it is. First episode is going to be on your channel. Go. Just go. Right, yo, so what's good, my thing is, is, yo, we be talking about what be better extinctions. <laughs> why are you talking like that? We're gonna be talking about what's better, extinctions or zombies. I'm on the side of zombies. Joey got the side of extinction because... And, yeah, I, I think I'd rather go with extinction, to be honest, just because it's new and fresh. and I don't know, I like the difference with the aliens. I, I don't know, it's kind of a new, new thing. I enjoy the new experience. I mean, obviously, zombies has a lot more to it with the pack-a-punch and, you know, all these other things, but... Yes. I think I think they did too much with it, you know, like with the whole story, and that ruins it for me. I just want to kill zombies. I don't care about all these Easter eggs and I did stuff. think Black Ops 2 went a little too far into the story, and it wasn't focused on, like, killing zombies, but Black Ops 1 was okay. Yeah, Black Ops 1, uh, Black Ops 1 was decent. Kino was alright. All the other maps, I think, a little bit too much. That's just me, though. Okay, well, I, I love zombies. Zombies is like, like, it holds everything together. Like, the Treyarch, they have that, like, Treyarch already does amazing multiplayer, and they also do zombies. It's like the greatest thing ever. Zombies is just, when you don't feel like trying hard in a multiplayer match, or if you're not Joey, Zombies is really fun. Well, well I definitely agree Treyarch makes the better games, although that's another commentary. Yeah, the that's, that's a debate for another debate. Yeah, that's a debate for another debate, but definitely the zombies with the great multiplayer combined makes a great game, but I mean, I just think this extinction mode's gonna go a long way, in my personal opinion. Uh, I mean, don't get me wrong, extinction's not terrible, but like... No, I mean, you gotta understand that it just started, too. Comparing yes. the... Like, comparing, comparing night, uh, point of contact not to, uh, not, uh, what was not the sure first map? Yeah, yeah, not starting totem. Ex uh, ex extinction is obviously a lot better, given that it's like six years took them six years to finally make something. <laughs> yeah, true, true. I mean, S six you know years what? and like two game engines. You know what? But then again, Notch Your Totem was like big for me because my first game was World at War, and I still think today World at War is the best Call of Duty I've ever played, just because it was my first, and I had a lot, of, a lot of fun playing on Notch Your Totem with my friends. We would go upstairs and camp in that one random corner. We all have ray guns and Brownings and MG, I think, 32. So, I mean, that was pretty fun. But definitely Extinction is a lot more advanced and better. But, you know, I mean, this is like six years after Not yes. Your Tony, you said, right? So, yeah. I mean. But we, we both agree squads is shit. Squads oh. is shit. <laughs> oh, don't even get me started on squads. Survival mode was good. Oh. Ex uh, squads. No. I mean, it's not even a competition. It's like, like I played it a couple times and it brought up fun. my KD, but it's just not fun. It's not even like, you Infinity know. War tries too hard to be stupid. <laughs> you just get KEMs every day, every game in that. Yeah. I mean, it's just no, it's no fun. I mean. And then safeguard you know. is stupid too. What is safeguard? Oh wait, that's like the that's like. Yeah, the, that's like what they tried to replace survival. Yeah, I, uh, I like the spec ops. They should have brought that. They should have. Yeah, spec ops were not terrible. The spec ops were actually really fun trying to get all the songs. I had great memories on that, playing that with my friends. That wasn't such a bad idea. Maybe you know the next con. Yeah, maybe. bring back spec ops and survival. That was like that, that was the best combination. No spec. No, it should be spec ops and it should like the ones from MW two and then it should be extinction because yeah. I think extinction's really good, especially. Yeah. With this new DLC coming out, I want to see how the story plays out. If the story's actually more interesting, and I oh, can get more into it than Zom. Oh, I don't know, because I don't, you know, we I don't do. have. 
I watched I'm, it. I haven't watched anything. It's pretty interesting the way the map ends. Like, uh, I don't know uh, how like it ends ends, but like the ending cutscene is pretty cool. This is another thing. Like, I hate I hate like spoiling. Like, I don't know. Dylan looks up like a lot of the DLC before it even comes out, and like I'm just like you know I don't want to spoil it. I want you know to feel excited in the moment when I figure these kinds of things out, like what the ending is and. Extinction DLC, yeah, we, one, for example. We have yet to get to the nuke and in, in, uh, in point of contact. We have yet to get there. Oh yeah, we. When's the last time we even played Extinction? I don't know. Let's play that after we finish this. Me, you, and Brandman. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't, I don't even know. But I, I definitely think Extinction is. A Ex little Extinction bit is good, but there is one thing. They need to expand the amount of things you can do. Like, everybody already unlocked all the stuff. Like, they need to add more things. Like, uh, you know how they have, like, the century of the stuff? They I, I need guess, more of that. I guess. But the thing is, I like how you can, like... Make your class. Like, well, yeah, and there's, like, cer there's certain things Extinction has over zombies, and there's certain things zombies have over Extinctions. I really... One thing I like about Extinction is I like... The random pickups you can get around the map, like you can just yeah, get the red, red dot. You don't have to pay five thousand points, pack a punch, and get a random site that you don't even know. You yeah, know I feel what, like zombies should have like sites on the walls or something that you can actually buy. Yeah, that that would be that would be good. You know, that's kind of another thing I like. I about. like the uh, the ammo types in Extinction, where like you could get like the fire ammo and stuff. And that's that's pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, I'll I'll give zombies one thing is that. I think honestly, Extinction would be very boring to watch just because you know you got a place down. It's like very repetitive. You're very no, well you're very stationary. That's what I was going to go with it. You know when you're watching zombies, people are usually running trains, running around, running trains, running all over. Everybody's just like playing the drill. Yeah, you're basically just sitting on in one spot watching a drill. Just you know, I mean it's it yeah, drill, drill, enjoyable, but. I don't, I don't know if it's as enjoyable as to watch as zombies, but I still think Extinction will eventually progress to become the better series, you know. And Call of Duty Ghosts 3. Ghosts. Of ghosts. <laughs> what's the what's the Sledgehammer game going to be? Does anybody know? Is, isn't the Sledgehammer... I don't know if they're even making one. I mean, I, T. Martin made that video, but what I think is going to happen is Sledgehammer is probably going to make the... Uh, like the PS3 version of uh, whatever, and then Treyarch and Infinity Ward, they're gonna make like next gen games, so they could focus on that. That would make no sense, but we're getting off topic. Yeah, I'm I would. Just, like how I'm the just, uh, when, it, when just, Infinity Ward makes a game, Treyarch needs to take that game and put it on the Wii version because Infinity Ward's too lazy to do that. <laughs> right. Okay, that's a debate for a different time. All right, guys, that's all we got time for. Don't forget to deep fry that yeah. like button. And uh, oh, I had a saying. For, oh, I had a saying for the sub subscribe button. And I gotta yeah, think. check out my channel. Check out the Inner Warrior. We'll put it in the ah, we'll put it in the description, I guess, right? Oh, what was yeah? I'll put it in the description. What was the name for that? I had a thing for the sub box. It was so cool. Uh, so, maybe maybe something about no. I, I think it related to sandwiches. I thought for some reason it might relate to bacon or ham, considering you're a hog, but... Uh. Uh, it'll come to me, uh, just for now. Oh. Sink that sub button, and goodbye.